Hey, it's Midnight Raven, and today from my cosy little flat in my dressing gown, we are going to look at the everything5pounds.com Facebook previews, which are currently up today. So let me explain what I mean. Basically, Everything 5 Pounds has a Facebook page. And the night before, um, around tea time, they will put previews up for the next day. And they go live around 7 to 8 o'clock in the morning of the next day. It's to get a head start on looking up what's new, making a list, and then shopping. So we're going to take a look at the website. It's a Facebook page, but they also have a website which has all the items and everywhere you can um, buy from. This is to show you just the preview from the night before of the stuff that then goes live today as I'm now filming. So let's check out what's gone live. If you want to see the um, page, I have uh, linked it down below. So the first dress we are looking at is this beautiful satin um, long dress. I like the little pocket details at the top. Um, obviously they're fake pockets because you can see they overhang. But it is kind of um, like one of those kind of statement pieces. Maybe you'd wear it to dinner. Um, maybe wear it for New Year. Although we're, we're not actually going anywhere for New Year now, are we? Next we have is this long kind of duster coat, I think they're called. Nice camel brown. Not really into browns uh, myself. Here we go. Look at this. Gorgeous. Now, I don't know if it's the top or the skirt that they're trying to show because they'll show the entire outfit, but you won't know which piece is actually available. I think they try and make as many pieces on the model available as possible. But this kind of blush pink um, skirt isn't too bad. I'm not so fan of a wrap around top. The fabric kind of clings to you. Next. Ooh. Now we've got some green boots with some studs. I'm not really into studs on items of clothing. I don't know. Feels a bit industrial, kind of. I wouldn't say homemade, but just imagine someone at home with a pair of boots with a hot glue gun and some studs and they just kind of put them on themselves. The colour's not too bad though. Nice autumn colour. Next, scarves. Now we won't be in scarf season at forever, but at the minute... It is kind of chilly, don't get me wrong. Not liking the pattern, and I don't like a scarf too big because I feel like I've been swamped. Next, I believe we're looking at the blouse, which is a kind of, I want to say it's like a brown one. It's kind of see-through. If you look at the middle of her midriff, you kind of see her skin through it. So you're going to need to have um, a black bra through this. Um... Because it looks kind of sheer towards the middle. That's just my personal opinion. This handbag is kind of cute. We've got silver. Let me embellish this a bit. Look at that. Really kind of cute. This is kind of that statement bag that maybe you take to dinner on your anniversary. Maybe take it out for Valentine's. Cozy jumper season is still on us. And this coral colour is kind of cute. I've never worn like a coral ready kind of colour before. But it does look like a really chunky knit. And I do like chunky knits. Next we have watches. I don't wear watches. Um, I have worn a watch before. How many people wear watches? Comment down below if you still wear a watch. I think a lot of people don't. They've either got Fitbits or smartphones. But I like the fact that it kind of contrasts, so that's kind of cute. Next, we have this top, which is clearly an explosion. I, I just don't get the pattern. It's all a bit in your face, the pastels, the whole lot, really. Nice, but just not for me. Now, these shoes are kind of cool. I like the whole open toe buckle kind of thing they've got a buckle on the side you've got an open toe it's definitely not a winter shoe but you could wear these in the spring maybe or like I said if you're going out to dinner now if you watched my video yesterday there was a green dress um, this is similar um, it's a bit more kind of um, 
this one's kind of more shaped to your body the other one was more like a like a ball kind of baby doll dress kind of had like a more poofiness to it this i like it's, i'm not sure about the tie in the middle it looks like a bit of string but i'm sure it'll look great do love the color though now these are quite nice cropped um, little jackets can come in handy especially in the spring and summer when you're going out for dinner and all the movies or just going for a walk on the beach and you're a little chilly but not too chilly you just whack one of these on and i did say that muted colors were in this season browns grays i'm not sure if i'm right but judging by this the grays are are coming back like this bag it's just a simple kind of silvery white bag very simple with a chain next we have more pinks pinks are in as well so i'm guessing it's a gray and pink season which i'm not angry at. i don't like pinks personally but here we have a blush pink cardigan we've got a blush pink kind of bag and then we've got like this three-tone um skirt which i'm not really a fan of and then hopefully in january i might start ordering stuff and doing try on hauls um once everything calms down a bit with the pandemic so now you've got this nice cropped top which kind of likes nice the cropped jacket and then this dress looks kind of cute i think it's meant to be like flower pattern i'm not too sure but i like that one gloves again these are similar to the gloves they showed yesterday where they had the little stud kind of bee decoration down it and they were um fingerless these ones are kind of similar they've just got little stud details down the side and they're not now this one's kind of cool the kind of drapey wrap over dress love the blue color um i don't know about the whole like fan detail on it but it looks kind of cool i do like that they're trying to be innovative with their clothes it seems like these people um i will explain what everything five pound is at the end but these boots are kind of nice i don't know if i like the whole cut of the boot it looks very like square but cute again camels and black skinny jeans you know my opinion on skinny jeans if you watched the previous video i don't do skinny jeans but if you do skinny jeans these would be perfect next more cozy winter pajamas obviously cozy pajamas can be all year round obviously if they have christmas written on them probably harder to wear them all year but you're in your own home if you want to wear cozy xmas pajamas all year round who am i to stop you next more skinny jeans skinny jeans are a big thing on here they sell a lot of skinny jeans i must admit and this nice kind of dark off black kind of color kind of wash look next hats if you know me i wear a hat all the time and this blush pink little bobble hat kind of cute more blush pink again these have the lace trail um sleeves you've also got the collar with the cutout very cute just not for me more white and kind of silvery color bag again going for the padded effect on the front with the little silver chain very delicate handbags today another cute little watch with the little flower detail we did have one yesterday that looked kind of similar more candy stripes if you watch yesterday we had a red and white candy stripe top and today we're rocking a whole color palette we've got cream white silver and black not my kind of thing with the whole like massive amounts of color my clothes are kind of i want to say two-tone like black and white purple and black these are kind of nice with the zip detail down the front if not it would be kind of a plain shoe but with the zip detail it kind of make gives it a little bit of more of an accent and here we have some yellow we had some yellow yesterday there was that gorgeous not for me but for somebody else um yellow jumper that was bright yellow i believe now here we got the yellow again but now we have like candy i want to call them candy stripes or rainbow stripes on the sleeve i wonder how many people buy that not noticing the rainbow stripe now here we have something cozy a nice blue sweater i've actually got a teal sweater that i got that was similar to this um before christmas which you would have seen 
in um, nothing at the minute because I haven't shown it to you. But I have a teal jumper that's coming um, in my what I got for Christmas because I bought it from everything five pounds. Next, we have a pair of shoes that I kind of like, but I don't like heels with pointy toes. Um, these are kind of pointy. The nice checkered black and white design is really cute, though. More blush pink. Blush pink seems to be in. At the minute, it's blush pink, neutral, and kind of greys, which isn't a bad colour palette for the year. Uh, nice hoodie. Now we have some orange loafers. Not really into orange. If the loafers were in a different colour, I would possibly be interested. More slippers. These are neutral, just normal neutral grey ones with the heel out. They look kind of cosy. Um, I don't know. How many people wear slippers that don't have backs on them? Um, are they... And here we have the jumper of the day. So this is a jumper vest and it is it is bright. Even on my phone, it probably doesn't do it the justice it would do in real life. But we have like a netted jumper. It is, it is very, very yellow. And that is the preview. As you can see, it won't go up anymore. This is the preview for today, which is the 18th of December. And all of these items have gone live as of this morning, around 7 to 8 o'clock. And I am filming this just before 9 so when I put this up, um, you'll be able to hopefully shop for what's left. Um, hopefully there'll be some left. So basically all these brands and how they can afford to sell them at £5, they buy all old stock from companies like X lines, um, X sizes, maybe things that didn't sell so well because they weren't really what people wanted. And they put them all on this site called Everything £5 and they sell them off at £5 a piece. And sometimes you get really good deals. You have items from Topshop. There's been items from Miss Selfridge on here. Next. There's been items from really high-end fashion places that you're getting for a fiver. If they're really high-end fashion, they do count the tags out so you don't know where they come from. But in fairness, sometimes the tag is pretty obvious. You can tell what the actual dress is just by kind of looking at it about where it came from so if you want to see more of these give me a big thumbs up i'm trying to do like a week of these and see how uh, my um, channel does whether this is something people would be interested in the previews the previous um, night i'd love to do the previews the night before at the minute i'm doing them in the morning to see um, how they do and then i want to do a night where i do the previews the night before the morning and see how that goes it's basically waiting for everything five pounds to put them up to be able to do the previews, rushing it, getting it filmed, getting it edited, and then putting it up before the morning. Or it's doing this where they go live at eight and then I film afterwards and show you what's still available. But things do sell out fast and everything five pounds. Don't be shocked if you go on there at half eight and find out whatever you want is sold out. Things sell really quick. But if you like this format, me either filming it in the morning or filming it the night before, let me know. I will see which one I can do um, and that fits in with my schedule. But yeah, give me a big thumbs up, like, subscribe. Check out yesterday's one if you want. There was a chance that stuff is still available from the previous days. Um, and there will be a playlist on my channel if you want to see previous ones and see the entire ranges. I've literally done today and yesterday. And I'm going to finish the week out and see whether you like the content. Um, and let me know down below if you order anything. Obviously, I'd love to know. If you also have a channel yourself, tell me your channel down below. And then if you do a haul, I'll be able to see the clothes as well. That would also be kind of cool. And in the new year, obviously when things have calmed down a bit and the postage has eased up, I'm going to order some stuff and start doing some try-on hauls through the year. So you're going to get double content which would be awesome. So like, subscribe, and I'll see you soon for another video. Take care and thanks for watching. Bye.